Now we have another example on how to compute the times and heights of high and low water and secondary heaven. So this is uh, tides with large journal eh, equality. So this is dated January 16. So again, using the following extract. But uh, if you're going to compute for the actual secondary port you need to go to the pages where you can find those extract and you can find it in the Admiralty Tide Tables as you can see here part 2 now let's go to the computation so the problem now we're going to get the times and heights of high water and low water in secondary heaven at uh, January 16 so here is the standard port it was extracted from the Admiralty Tide Tables Part 1 so you need to go to January 16 so to peel up The title prediction form number one, two, three, and four. What says in the instruction for secondary port? One to four. Enter the high water and low water times and height at standard port. Admiralty tide tables part one. So this was extracted or took in January 16, standard port. So in high water, the highest is in 11.44, that is 2.5. So you need to put beside the high water is 2.5. Next is low water. So again, this is the morning, in the morning, and this is in the afternoon. So next is the low water in the morning is 0254. So you're going to put it here on the box number two. That's in the low water. 0254. And beside and on your side is 0 0.8. As you can see there is 0 0.8. Next in the afternoon we have 1618. So if you're going to compare it in the afternoon, 1.7 is lower than 2.1. Okay? So therefore, 1618 is the low water. So you're going to put it here in box number 2 for low water. Can you see it? 1618. So beside is 1.7. There. Next is the high water, 2025. There, 2025 for the high water. And on the side is 2.1. Okay. Now, let's go into the seasonal change. Standard port. So in seasonal change, you can see it in the Admiralty Tide Tables Part 2. Okay. So as you can remember, it was January. So the seasonal change for the standard is negative 0.1. Again, why is it indicated here positive? Because in the instruction for secondary port, in number 6, enter the seasonal change at standard port with sign change. Admiralty Tide Tables Part 2. So you need to sign change or change the sign. So therefore, the negative will going to be positive, so that will be positive 0 0.1, positive 0 0.1, okay? Now, the next is the secondary port. You can also extract it in the Admiralty Tide Tables Part 2. So for the secondary port, there is no seasonal change. That is 0. So you're going to put 0, okay? 
Now, how can we get the this data in number 9 and number 10? So we need to interpolate if there is no exact value for 2.5. So let's see if there's an exact value for 2.5. So there is an exact value for 2.5 that is negative 1.2. So you're going to put it here, 1.2, negative 1.2. Let's see if there's an exact value of 2.1. There is no 2.1, but it is near in 2.2. <coughs> Excuse me. So therefore, we can get negative 1.1. Negative 1.1, okay? So let's see if there is an exact value of 0 0.8. There is no exact value for 0 0.8. Therefore, we need to interpolate to get the exact value for 0 0.8. So here. So to interpolate, we need to put or we need to inspect where should we put 0 0.8. So that is between 1.9 and 0 0.4. So you need to put 1.9 above. Next is 0 0.8, the value that we need to get, then 0 0.4. Okay? So the value of 1.9 is equals to... 0 0.9 there then the value of 0 0.8 that is unknown so we put x next the value of negative 0.1 here beside the 0 0.4 0 0.4 0 0.4 negative 0 0.1 0 0.1 okay so 1.9 minus 1 point uh, 1.9 minus 0 0.8 is equals to 1.1 1 1.9 1 .1 minus 0 0.4 is equals to 1.4 negative 0 0.9 minus x is equals to x 0 0.9 minus 0 0.1 negative that will give you negative 0 0.8 so to transpose you get x x over 0 0.8 negative equals to 1.1 over 1.5 so to cross multiply x you need to let x on the left so 1.1 multiplied by negative 0.8 divided by 1.5 you will give uh, it will give you x equals to negative 0.58 so this is not yet the value of 0 0.8. This is only the value of that what we get. This is the difference. So to get that, the negative 0 0.9, you put it here, minus the value that you get on the x, 0 0.58, negative. So 0 0.8 minus 0 0.58, it will give you a value of 0 0.32. So, Therefore, 0 0.8 is equal to negative 0 0.32. So, that is negative 0 0.32. But what we have here on the example at the Admiralty Thai tables, they put 0 0.4. No? They might uh, round it up to 0 0.4. Now, to get the value of this box number 12 and 13 11 44 minus 15 minutes it will give you 11 29 20 25 minus 15 minutes it will give you 20 10 0 2 5 4 minus 25 minutes it will give you 0 2 2 9 1 6 1 8 minus negative or minus 25 minutes it will give you 15 53 okay now to get box number 14 and 15 so let's take a recap about the box number 12 and 15 so calculate the secondary high water so box one adjusted by the box seven box two by box eight box three so that's what we do in here so in number 12, 13, 14, 15.
Okay. Now to get 1.4, you need to subtract. This. For example, two two point five. Plus 0.1 minus 1.2. So it will give you 1.4. Okay? Can you see it? 2.1 plus 0.1 minus 1.1, it will give you 1.1. 0 0.8 plus 0.1. Minus 0.4, it will give you 0 0.5. Now, 1.7 plus 0.1 minus 0.9, it will give you 0 0.9. Okay? So, that's how we compute the times and heights uh, of heights and low waters. And that is on the secondary report example is Haven.